We are here today at the Douglas County Courthouse and we are celebrating our class of 2024 graduates. Um, all the visual artists from all the five high schools are represented here and they are really excited to share their work with everyone. This is the first year that we did this here um, for the seniors specifically and the, the work that is showcased is a essentially a year and a half of hard work that my seniors have put in. This is my second year at Alexander so my seniors are the ones that I had from the, my beginning there last year. So I'm very sad to see them go, but I'm so very proud of them. They have worked so hard and have accomplished so much. The, what I've seen them do and grow has been amazing. So my senior exhibit was about just growth and this part of this was about the topic of love. So it's just representing like me being lost in love and the white rose is for the innocence and the green is for the growth, of course. What inspired it, it was a, um, a project we had to do that involves two words. So I chose Mother Nature. I've been applying for colleges and I've been thinking a lot about how like the most of the stuff that they see is just test scores, your transcript. I did a self-portrait and then um, kind of covered a lot of the face with my test scores. So I have my ACT scores, SAT scores, PSAT scores. And so I kind of wanted to show that um, those test scores kind of really cover up everything else. You don't get to see too much else with college applications. I, mean, I can't go a day without drawing or at least doodling something. So I just really love art. And even when I hate making it, I make sure I keep it so I can look back on it. It's taught me patience. Because with art, you there's always going to be like, you know, someone who may be better than you. And you just have to like not compare yourself to others and learn it's okay it takes time to work up your art style to learn how to do different techniques to learn how to use different mediums so definitely patience and being open-minded to new things that's what artists taught me. I hope that they remember to stay positive um, I hope that they remember to take the good out of every single day I hope that they remember that they have to keep creating in order to stay creative um, I hope that they keep conversations and dialogues with people that are going to be important with them. They hold our conversations as well as conversations they have with new friends and people that they encounter very close and that there's always an opportunity to make something. The world needs art. I really want them to take their critical thinking skills that I've tried to help them with because those skills can transfer to any walk of life. It's not just art how to be confident in solving a problem that you've never faced before. And being okay with trying new things, even if you're gonna fail, and that is okay. That's what I want them to take with them.